but we up there, we filming. Shalawam, 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 shalawam. Shalawam. All right. Before we even get started in this listen, first and foremost, want to start by giving all praises and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem, Rakakadash. Secondly, want to give double honors to the elders, apostles of the great millstone who rule well. And third, want to give salutation to all the occupants of the hopeful elect that pushing forth this word and this truth and righteousness, sincerity throughout the four corners. Shalom, 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 shalom. Brother Hakar, GMS South Carolina Midlands. Um, brother Yeramya from the uh, branch of GMS South Carolina Midlands as well. Kind, kind, man. And see right here, this listen that we're going to go into um, this evening here. It's raining, it's raining evening here, you right, know what I'm saying? Right, right. Raining cats and dogs, literally. But nevertheless, man, you know what I'm saying? We're going to get into, you know what I'm saying? Light has entered into this world, man. All uh, right? And that light, starting off with our big bro, Yahweh Shai, and that light represents what this wisdom, knowledge, sure. and understanding of this truth, man. That's right. All right? And this light ain't being given to everybody at the end of the day. It's only given to a certain sector of Israelites, man. Uh, all right? It represents the elect, the one-third, man. Mm -hmm. It represents the elect. All right, uh, yeah, how about me? How we shot, man? Right, all right. You had a scripture already, brother. You had one to bring up, uh, precept, or you no, just no, okay, okay, no, okay. Like you ready to bring a precept out, brother. Yeah. All right, <laughs> but nevertheless, man, we're gonna get into it, man. Because that's just like prime example, man. You know what I'm saying? If you in, like, let's say you in a damn room and you turn the lights off and end up a bunch of damn darkness, and you know what I'm saying? It's dark as hell in the goddamn fucking room, no light can, 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 can penetrate through that damn room and shit. Man, you know what I'm saying? Your ass can be fall stumbling over shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You trying to feel your way around the motherfucking room or whatnot, man. You know what I'm saying? You know? Yeah. So, so, but, but no sooner when you hit that goddamn light on, man, you hit that light switch, man, e every damn thing is fucking clear, man. You can see everything, man. Your mm -hmm. eyes are fucking open, man, at the end of the damn day. All yeah. right. You know, it's like prime example, if, you know, end up with pure darkness. You can't even see the the damn pit holes or what. Let's say some damn some damn pit holes and shit down there, bro. Right, right. You can't see you can't see the pit holes and shit or whatnot, man. You know what I'm saying? Full of darkness. Mm -hmm. But if you got some motherfucking light and shit, you know what I'm saying? You can see all the pit holes there is, bro. All the snares there is at the end of the damn day, man. That's right. That's all right, right, you know. Mm. And this light represents, like I say, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding it represents the truth, man. Yeah. All right. Now all these fucking lies that was taught by fucking Esau, man, and push out there by Esau, man. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact. Mm -hmm. Um, let's start with Isaiah 60 and 2, Barbecue Show. Let's start with Isaiah 60 and 2, bro. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 60, at verse 2. And it reads, For behold, the days shall slack it. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth. The darkness shall cover the earth, man, because you had the wicked. You know what I'm saying? Esau, all right, going back to Job, Job 9, that's why I say Job, but going back to Job yeah. 9 and 24, yep. you know, the earth, is, earth it has been given into the hand of the uh, wicked, wicked, man, yep. through the power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. That's right. All right. That's right. So, you know what I'm saying? When Esau, when he's ruling, he's ruling in wickedness, man. Matter of fact, we get, um, like, after we read Isaiah 16 and 2, mm -hmm. um, Barbara Kushaw, get Nahum 3 and 1, man. Mm. All God, right. God. You know, and then after Nahum 3 and 1, no, no, no. Before we get Nahum 3 and 1, we get Psalms 58 and 3. All right? And we get Psalms 58 and 3. Well, sir. you can read... Matter of fact, Shalak, get Psalms 58 and 3 now, bro. Con, yeah, that should go con. first. Yeah, yes, Shalak. sir. Let's get Psalms 58 and 3 real quick, Barbara Show. Con. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 58 and verse 3. It says, the wicked are estranged from the womb. It says, the wicked are estranged from the womb, and that wicked is Sleazy. representing Sleazy E, man. Mm -hmm. Esau, the so-called white man. When right. you read, when you read in the book of Malachi one and four, four. Yep. all right, one and four tell you who the wicked is, man. Mm -hmm. All right, do you have wicked amongst all the nation of people? Yes. Yeah. But you have the wicked, yep. all right, which is third category of man, all right, which is Esau, starting with your super elite on down, mm -hmm. man. The rest of you got them Edomites, man. Yep. All right, and you can read that in Malachi one and four. One and four. All right, going into the who the wicked is, and also the order of wickedness, and also when you can read in in the book of Maccabees, which we brought out uh, oh, right. over the weekend. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Maccabees, Mac Mac the, the, the first chapter. Maccabees, the first chapter, where it goes into uh, uh, where it goes into that um, after Alexander the Creep, after he passed, his yep. generals took. You know what I'm saying? His generals came in power. Yep. All right, took his seat, so to speak. And in the scripture tell you that wickedness was multiplied, multiplied in, the world, in the world. Showing you that yep. Esau is the wicked according to the scriptures, man. Yep. All right. But yeah, you can get uh, Psalm 58 and 3, Barbara Michelle. Sure. Con. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 58 and verse 3. It says, the wicked are estranged from the womb. 
They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. You can speak on it, bro. Yep, and that's talking about the wicked Esau Edom, man. You know, the Lord literally created this devil to be the wicked. He can't be no other uh, no other than wicked, man. Mm -hmm. You know? And, and the, see, the, it's mm -hmm. schlock. I ain't going to cut you no, off, you brother. Go. That's why this world was was hit with gross darkness. Because you got the wicked that's ruling. Yeah. Psalms 15 and 3. It's going to tell you Esau is a, not only he's a natural born killer. He's mm -hmm. a natural born mm -hmm fucking killer but he also a natural born liar as well too man right his, his kingdom is built off of fucking lies, lies man yeah. deceit all right fraud at the end of the damn day man mm -hmm. all right that's why scripture tell you in second Thessalonians 2 and 8 this devil had to be revealed, revealed. why he had to be revealed because he fucking lied about every fucking thing even his fucking nationality man yeah. he lied to say he was the most high all right, he lied to say he was the Lord. He lied to say he was the children of Israel, which is all them fucking lies at the end of the day, bro. Yeah, yeah. All right, gross darkness to people, man. That's why Jake is in gross darkness even to this very day, because they'll they, they argue up and down that the Lord is a so called white man. man. Yeah. All right, the Lord love everybody. They think he got blonde hair and blue eyes and shit. Mm -hmm. They're not even knowing that having blue eyes and and blonde hair that's a recessive that's gene at the end of the day that's leprosy man right. leprosy man mm -hmm. at the end of the day man that's a gross darkness this devil did to our, to our people man yep. all right by him being in rulership man mm -hmm. all right seeing the importance of the light man that's why they hated yahweh shaka he was that light man mm. He was the truth at the end of the day, man. Um, and the men of the Lord come in the spirit of Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shah. We're lighting. We, we're that light. We're we bringing that light upon all this fucking darkness, darkness man. Yeah. And these lies, the stumbling blocks that Esau set before our people, man. Mm -hmm. All right? You got it, bro. That's right. And, you know, just getting this, you already quoted it. This is Job 9 to 24. It says, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. All right, we know who the wicked is, Esau. Right. All right. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and that's how you know who's ruling it ain't. That's right. Esau, the so-called wicked, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, but those who want to sit up there and say Esau done away with it, Esau ain't the so-called white man. Those fucking lies right there. Esau is the so-called white man. Right. Anybody teaching that man? Hey man, Revelation 22, 18 and nineteen. You mm -hmm. add it and you take, take it away it from away. the scriptures. Yeah. So Yahweh Shemar Shah gonna have your ass written out of the book of life, man. Mm. For you damn false prophets out there, yep. bro. That teaching otherwise because you don't fucking soul out, man. Yep. Or you got a hard on for Esau, man. Mm -hmm. Whatever the case may be. Yep. All right, you niggas going off, man. God. And and if you don't repent. All right, and get the song correct, which you niggas not. I should go into you false prophets, false man. Prophets, All man. right, you know what I'm saying? Hey, man, y'all gonna meet your fate, man, from your how about your mouth was shot. Mm -hmm. And ain't gonna be nothing pretty at the end of the day, man. You're gonna right. die, gonna die but fucking pain, man. The torment. The torment, man. Yeah. All right, Yahweh Shem Shah gonna bring to you niggas, man. Mm -hmm. That's why we bringing that light into this world through the spirit of Yahweh Shem Shah, man. That's right. All right, you know? That's, right. That's why the world hates us, man. Because they hated Yahweh Shem Shah, who is the light. Mm -hmm. So we come to the spirit of Yahweh Shem Shah. All right, and we come to condemn this wicked ass fucking world, man. Like Yahweh Shem Shah. Right. Guess what? They, 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 they sought to put us to death, man. Mm -hmm. Just like you brought out, um, I believe that was I believe that was you, um, brother, where you was uh, made a comment that in um, Canada, you know what I'm saying? They're banning. Um, um, uh, street Preach, preachers street street on the highways shot. and byways, mm -hmm. man. Cause they, they, cause, oh, Shalot, that was your quiet. Mm -hmm. they, you know what I'm saying? They, you know what I'm saying? They demon them, hate, you know what I'm saying? Oh, that, that hate speech. Hate speech, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know? So, they, you know, they're coming to Babylon too. Yeah. All right. You know what's going on in Canada? They're coming to Babylon too, man. They Amos to 8 and 11. Small hat or slot. Yeah. No, nah, you good. You know, bro. You know pretty much they're trying to ban uh, free speech because they're trying to protect the small hatters. Right. Which is the Amalekites of the scriptures, these Edomites. Who pretty much done spread all these lies? They, you right. know, they they set themselves up as if they are the the uh, the children of Israel, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and they know damn well they not the people, man. They right. know that we are the people. So when we go out there and push the truth, a Yahweh Shemiah Shai, the truth is gonna stand. It's That's gonna right. stand over a lie, man. You know, That's it's right. overcoming the lies. Right. Um, you know, we pulling down those strongholds. Yeah, cause know? a lie, the lie gonna get set. The lie, they push a lie first, but then the truth come right behind it, bro. Yep. All right, you know what I'm saying? The truth. It, it, it stand the test of time, man. Cause the truth right. is the truth, bro. A That's lie right. can only stand for a limited time, man. Mm -hmm. All right, just like when they got specials or whatnot, they they be selling specials. It's limited time. You better yeah, go ahead and, and you got to go ahead and buy it, cause it's only limited time. Yeah. Be, hey, these lies are fucking limited. Esau, your ass fucking limited, man. Yeah. All right, most I about to bring his ass out of power, man. So he right. limited. He got limited time in his kingdom, bro. Mm -hmm. Most I about to bring his punk ass out of power. You can finish up, my brother. God, this is Job nine to twenty four. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. He covered the faces, man. There you go with that defraud and there we go with that deceit at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. All right, how, how did he cover the faces going through, you know what I'm saying? I iconoclasm, man. Yeah. All right, you got that Maccabees, bro, where he oh, thinking yeah. enlightened the images or whatnot. Oh, yeah, I got that. You know what I'm saying? Right. Cause that's why you had these crackers getting all mad and getting all pissed off. Yep. You know what I'm saying? When um you had Putin, 
you know, president of Russia mm -hmm. when he bought out those Russian icons, man, yeah. of Jake, man. All right, when he was ruling, all right, you know what I'm saying? You know, um, during the Dark Ages mm -hmm. for over a thousand years in Europe. And I also mm -hmm. bought out the, the image, the, uh, the depiction of Yahweh Shai. I'm not saying that's uh -huh. Yahweh Shai, but that's the depiction mm -hmm. pertaining to Revelation, the first chapter yeah. of Yahweh Shai, man. A dark skinned man. Mm -hmm. The Hebrew Israelites are dark skinned men. The angels are dark skinned men that's at right. the end of the day. That's bro. Right. You know? And, and the truth is coming out, man. Mm -hmm. uh, over, over these fucking lies, it's all pushed out there, man. Yep. All right, you got it, bro. Con. And it's not as if we needed those things. Right, you know, right. We already knew through the spirit. But, mm -hmm. you know, Esau being a carnal man, you know, he want to be, he want to see tangible evidence. Well, mm -hmm. we got it. That's right. That's you know, right, there that's was right. relics left behind, man, that, yeah. that proves that we are the children of Yahweh Shai, man. That's right. Children that's of right. Israel. That's right, brother. That's right. It says, Job 9 and 24, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? So if ain't a so-called white man, then who 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 is it, man? Who yeah. is it? If ain't a so-called white man, then who the fuck Esau is? Who the wicked is at the end of the day? Right. They know, but this damn devil fulfilled fulfill those prophecies at the end of the damn day, man, mm -hmm. to the T, man. Esau put up his ugly ass image. Cedric Boy's right, right. Said so he was the most high. He's the Lord. Mm -hmm. Alright, got an image. You know, the Lord and, and Adam, like, they butt naked, touching fucking fingers. See, you niggas got to pay for all that, man. Wow. When I say niggas, I'm talking about you fucking Edomites. You the yeah. original red niggas original at the end nigga. of the goddamn day, man. <laughs> yeah. You got the angels butt naked, looking like looking like little babies, babies and shit, man. All right, you know? Zesty babies at that. All right. Okay, you devils got to pay for all that shit, man. All right? You got it, bro. Man, this all is all. All the lies, man, the devil put out there, man. And we used to believe that shit at one time, man. Yeah, we did. All right, you know? Okay, when but that's showing you you know, we was in darkness, man. Mm -hmm. But showing you, man, this devil every day, Yahweh about your was shy, step closer, pull this devil ass out of power, that's man. That's right. All right. That's right. You got it, bro. This is first Maccabees chapter three and verse forty eight, and laid open the book of the law, wherein the heathen has sought to paint the likeness of their images. Mm -hmm. And that's e sleazy E. The book of the law is going into the holy scriptures, man. That's right. You know, he knew that uh uh Judah you know, uh, uh, all the tribes. We right. were all melanated, man. Right, right. You know, but the scriptures going to how Judah is black. Mm -hmm. You know, Jeremiah the, what? Jeremiah what? Fourteen and two. Fourteen yeah. two. Yep. Uh, uh, going into Revelation one, mm -hmm. uh, verse thirteen on down, describing Yahweh Shai. Mm -hmm. There's another one in Daniel's as well, mm -hmm. describing the Lord. Mm -hmm. They knew that we was melanated, man. Mm -hmm. So when they they saw, uh, you know, that we are the chosen people, and they wanted to. Uh, take our heritage mm -hmm. hey they say we gotta erase that that's right. where iconoclasm you know mm -hmm. knocking the noses off statues mm -hmm. lightening up the images and this is this is going into esau man how, how you gonna tell the people that you enslaving that they're gods they're children of gods at the end of the day they ain't gonna work man right all right you're you gonna have to make lies up and make yourself as if you god or whatnot you know mm -hmm. what i'm saying you know and have that mind control you know what i'm saying and try to disconnect us from our true power at the end of the day or whatnot yeah and this devil's still thinking he's gonna get his birthright back which he's not man no which he which he in the strong like i said you how about your mouth i got this devil in a strong delusion at the end of the day man you know mm -hmm. you got it bro god you you you'll, you'll finish that um yeah i'll finish that that okay. uh maccabees we got that i'd say uh matter of fact matter of fact matter of fact uh, uh, psalms 53. matter of fact hold that get um Get Jeremiah 14 and 2, because we quoted that. Get Jeremiah 14 and 2. God. Right, for sure. Yes, sir. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 14, and verse 2, and it reads, Judah mourneth, and the gates thereof languish. Mm -hmm. They are black unto the ground. Yeah, yeah, the gates, man, because who be at the gates? The leaders, man. The leaders, yeah. All right, the prophets, man, the men of the Lord, man. Mm -hmm. And at one time, you know what I'm saying? Because you got to remember the scriptures. How about Shema Shah said he set the apostles last, man. Mm -hmm. So you had to have all these damn... Fucking false prophets, man. These pork chop eating pastors yep. that was set up by Esau. All right, you had to have your Martin Luther Kings. Mm -hmm. You had to have your Malcolm X. Your, your goddamn Marcus Garvey's. Yeah. All right, all these people that are supposed to be so called civil right leaders and, and madness or whatnot. You know Jesse what I'm saying? Jackson. Jesse Jackass Jackson and whatnot. <laughs> all these false prophets, man. Yeah. All right, it had to be set up, man. All right, before you, how about your mouth? Shout set up the apostles, man. That's Which right. he said he saved them what for last, last. man. Yeah. That started with Elder Alva Bivens, man. Mm -hmm. All right. Which are old apostles, elders, and which is today Elijah. speeding up. Yeah, which are Elijah coming back in reincarnation, to bring us back to our fathers, right? To where you see what's going on today. You know what I'm saying? You you're seeing, you know what I'm saying? The uh, what, what's the word I want to use or whatnot, man? Awakening. You see, you seeing the, they, they, there you go. Huh. You seeing the huge awakening, man, yeah. of Israel, man. Yeah. All right, you know what I'm saying? You know, and that started with how about your mouth shot putting on the spirit uh, on Elder Apostle Hart to start uploading the videos on YouTube. Mm -hmm. The elders apostles. 
they predate the internet and YouTube. Right, right. But now, I, now I know what you call it, the phenomenon. You seen the phenomenon, mm -hmm. man. Israel is everywhere. Israel waking up everywhere yeah. to the point that, like I was saying, where you had Jaguar Wright, uh, a woman that was in the um, that, that that was up there in Hollywood, oh, was yeah. R&B singer. She was in the music industry, and would she just be spilling the beans on all these goddamn fucking celebrities and shit or whatnot, mm -hmm. man? Mm -hmm. All right, you know. And she shouted out the Hebrew Israelites at the end of the day or whatnot, uh -huh. showing you, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, that, like, El Paso Hard was doing a video pertaining to Jaguar, right? Pretty much going into, well, you how about Shemar Shah giving us that fame, man? Yeah. All right? You know what I'm saying? Like El Paso Hard said, man, how much more fame you think you're going to have? I rise out, we pray we those men. Hmm. When, you know what I'm saying? You start healing people, man. Yeah. All right? Performing miracles, For sure. man. Yeah. All right? And who, who, who getting that glory? Yeah, how about Shemar Shah, man? All right, cause we come in the name of Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. We can't do nothing without Yahweh Bashim Al Shah. That's right. Period, bro. That's right. So me, Yahweh Bashim Al Shah, he gonna get all the glory. He's gonna get. He gonna be exalted, man. And that day and that time, you gonna know who his men are. And that day and that time, man. That's right. That's right. All right, you know. And that's and that's what Esau is afraid of, man. That true light, man. The light already came in, bro. Yeah. All right. We follow the light, man. That's how. That's how we know. Mm -hmm. All right, you know. That most high still putting that. They putting them bright lights on. You know, you riding in dark, and you don't got a bright light. Oh shit, yeah. man. And yeah. that one, hey man, them bright lights, man. Blind me, wicked ass niggas, man. Mm -hmm. They hate that light, bro. Yep. Like roaches and shit, man. Turn the lights on, and the roaches start scattering For shit, real? man. And what niggas do, man? They say the wicked. Wicked to flee when no one pursue with them man, at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. They hate this truth, man. Yep. They hate this truth at the end of the day, bro. Mm -hmm. But nothing you gonna be able to do about it. Esau, all you wicked ass niggas, man. Yeah. All right, where, where, where was that, my brother? Nothing against, uh, nothing against the truth. But before. for the truth, man. There you, you go, know? brother. There you go, bro. Uh, I was just hoping what you had quoted. We're gonna get that praise and fame being okay. known as, you know, the children of Yahweh. She now shot. You gonna be speaking up loud, man. You got the damn rain. Nah, got the rain coming. Loud, man. This is Hosea, or Hosea, chapter one and verse ten. Yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea, which cannot be measured nor numbered. You know, we are, we are a vast nation of people, man. You know, just one of the tribes alone is, is like a nation in itself. Yeah, man. all the tribes are a nation. Yeah. Remember, the scripture tell you, one shall become a thousand. Man. Right. You know what I'm saying? You right. know? So, I mean, come on, man. That's why how about Shemar Bashar said, man, you can't count and you can't measure the sand on the sea, man. No, you cannot. It's innumerable at the you end know. of the day or whatnot, man. Okay, you you right. pick up some sand, you can't even number right. what you got right. in your hand, really. That's right. That's right. That's you know? That's right. And then you got uh, tr tr a tribe, uh, Ephraim, right? Mm -hmm. He is fruitful. Right, right, I right. I mean, right, right, you know, right, that right. tribe alone, I, I got an uh, Ephraim in my neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Man, he, he popping them out left and right, yeah. you know? <laughs> Hey, fulfill you know? it. Hey, that nomen omen, man. Right. That nomen omen, man. Right. You know? All right. Mm -hmm. You got it, brother. It says, to read on, Hosea 1 and 10, it says, and it shall come to pass, meaning prophecy, man. Mm -hmm. It says, that in the place where it was said unto them, ye are not my people. Man, over here in Babylon, man. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Over here in Babylon. You got mm -hmm. it, brother. There it shall be said unto them. Because over here in Babylon, they, they, you know, they don't, they don't say you so-called Negroes, Latino, Native Americans, you're children of Israel, right. you know, call you African Americans, call you Puerto Ricans, mm -hmm. Mexicans, Jamaicans, you know what I'm saying, Haitians, yeah. you know, Colombians, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying, you know, Native Americans, Seminole Indians, God. they call you every, they call you everything but the children of Yahweh about you, Yahweh Shah, man. Yahweh man. Yep. All right, you know them by words. Yeah, them by words, man. The curses. Yep. God ain't God ain't no so-called black man. They, they in that state of denial, man. Yeah. All right, end of the day. But the truth is out, man. Whether they want to accept it or not, the truth is out, man. It's out. Whether they hear or whether they forbear, forbear, man. That's right. You know, you got it, bro. That's right. It says, "There it shall be said unto them, Ye are the sons of the living power." Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? Because through prophecies and through scriptures. Y'all can't debunk what we saying, man. Yeah. All right. At the end of the day, man, you can't say that when you go, when you read Deuteronomy 28th chapter, 15 verse on down to 68, man, it ain't no fucking debate, man, who the children of Israel is through prophecy, right, man. Right. Right. Deuteronomy 28 46 said mm. that them curse is going to be upon thy seed forever and forever and forever and yeah. forever. All mm -hmm. right. That means age after age, man. Right. So you're going to know through prophecy who the children of Israel are, man. Mm -hmm. Ain't number one certain people, ain't number one sector of people fit those prophecies at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. All right? Israel going to be, we're going to be the tail, man. Mm -hmm. All right? You know what I'm saying? Hey, we going to, you know what I'm saying? Jake, hey, they going to leave, they going to, the Jake man going to leave his goddamn um, woman. They going to leave his family, man. All right. Who known for leaving the family and they and, and they pin, uh, they they put us as a poster child as deadbeat fathers, mm -hmm. man. 
You're not the father. You're not the father. Come on, right. man. But the Jake, bro. Jake, man. Jake. All right, making mockery of us through the curses at the end of the day, bro. Yep. All right, you know. Tell you we going, we gonna go into slavery with yokes of iron, bro. Mm -hmm. who, who, who was brought over here in slavery with yokes of fucking iron, Israel. man? Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, man. Northern mm -hmm. Kingdom, man. They fulfill that prophecy too for you dummies out there, bro. Yeah. All right, they was on the slave ships too for them dummies out there. Mm -hmm. Want to make the twelve tribes all Negro tribes? You going off, first, man? Eh? His, yeah, yeah, Christian Columbus, first. yeah. They were the first one set of slaves, yeah, man. Yeah. They were the first one um, to fit that, um, you know what I'm saying, the, uh, you the know, first, Deuteronomy um, 28 and 68, bro. Yeah. All right, taking on them ships, man. They fulfill that prophecy, too. Mm -hmm. But these clowns like they don't, they don't know fucking history, bro. Yep. All right, you got it, brother. Con, just getting what you had quoted. Uh, Deuteronomy 28, 46. Mm -hmm. It says, and they shall be upon thee for a sign and for a wonder mm -hmm. and upon thy seed forever. Mm -hmm. Going into the curses, man. It says it's going to be upon us for a sign. Mm -hmm. Well, you see these curses on this people, you know, which it ain't on you damn Amalekites. Right. Hell nah, man. You got everything. You own everything at the end of the damn day, man. Right. All right. You know? Okay. And then mm -hmm. the scripture tell you that Yahweh Shah is going to place, Yahweh Shah going to place us back in our homeland, bro. Right. All right. And we're going to have, and, and, and we're going to be with King David. Right. It was right, going right. to be our king. Well, Yahweh Shah, the ultimate king, and King David is right behind Yahweh Shah, man. Mm -hmm. Okay, his mm -hmm. throne going to be right up under Yahweh Shah, man. That's right. Or he That's next right. in line, bro. Where King David at, man? Yeah. Where, where, where the rest of the 12 tribes at, bro? Right. All right, at the end of the doggone day. And then mm -hmm. it's going to tell you when the true children of Israel and the land of Israel, Peace. it will be no more study of war no more, right. man. You won't, you won't study the war. We're going to break We're gonna break all the weapons of war, man. Yeah. That ain't, man, that ain't the case. You still got. I, Hell, you had Iran shooting damn asteroids over there in Israel, bro. Yep. They're going back and forth. Yep. So how they fulfill prophecy at the end of the day, bro? Mm -hmm. When they get back in their homeland, Yahabashim Hashem said, nobody shall make us afraid, bro, mm. at the end of the day. That's mm -hmm. not what's going on in the land today, bro. Right. Come on, man. Then they said, oh, everybody going to serve Yahabashim Hashem. Mm -hmm. They still got everybody serving their own daggone religion, their gods, or the other yeah. nations or whatnot, man. Yeah. So they, you cannot be the freaking people, man. Right. You don't fit prophecy at the end of the damn day, mm -hmm. man. You know? And these, that, that's why these damn devils want to regulate the internet. That's why they want to take away the TikTok and, and take away YouTube. You know what I'm saying? They want to shut down the internet all together and whatnot. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Because they can't control the narrative. So much information and truth and exposure been coming out on these fucking damn devils, right, man. Right, right. All right, end of the day, man. All right, you you can't just go on your damn dinosaur news back in the damn day, man. <laughs> yeah. All right, and put out what narratives you want to put out there or whatnot, man. Mm -hmm. right, the truth is out, bro. Truth is the out. truth is out, man. That's why they okay. want to shut down TikTok. Yep, because yep. Uh, TikTok is an app that's pretty much unfiltered when it mm -hmm. comes to information. It's a, it's a Chinese-owned app. That's right. So it's a lot of uh, truth and facts coming out. That's right. You know, hey, specific, specifically with uh, he, Putin revealing the the, uh, the images. And these devils got a lot of nerve, man. Here it is, Esau, his whole fucking history, he been putting out misinformation, man. Yeah. But then when you bring out truth on this devil, he, he, oh, that's misinformation. Misinformation. Miss medical, miss, miss medical misinformation. Yeah. Oh, you want to deem it's hate, hate. Hate. Cause we bringing our truth out of the scriptures is hate all of a sudden. Yeah. We a hate group now. The Hebrew Israelites is a hate group now, man. All right, cause we bringing out the we bringing out the truth, man. Truth. We in a hate group. We a truth group at truth the end group. of the day. Yeah. You fucking devils, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you got him, my brother. Well, they gross darkness as we yeah. read. Yeah. You exactly. saw that Jeremiah fourteen two. Con, yeah, you can bring it out, brother. God, this is Jeremiah fourteen two. It says Judah mourneth. And the gates thereof languish. Mm -hmm. They are black unto the ground. They are black, and that word black goes back to Kadar. Kadar. Now, when you yep. look at that word Kadar in the blue letter, Esau, the devil that he is, mm -hmm. he done switched the, switched the definition. I remember when I first came in the truth, they had a the correct definition there in the blue letter, bro. Yeah. It means Kadar means he's one of Ishmael's sons, and it means dark skin, mm -hmm. a person that's very dark skin at the end of the day, bro. Yep. All right, you know? Which I believe they still got it in the, uh, the Zondra. Remember, we looked it up that one time we was. Uh, you know, bringing out that information. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, in yeah. The it's still in the Zion of a Combat Bible Dictionary. True indeed, Brother Kind, mm -hmm. Kind, Kind. That's right, that's right. You it got says, it, and and the cry of Jerusalem is gone up. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that was the, pretty much the point. You know, we're, we're uh, melanated, man. That's right. And you Matt, know, go uh, ahead, Shlock. I ain't going to cut you no, off. No, you good, you go. Uh, you good. You getting go. excited, getting too Just excited. Just being uh, unmelanated, which Esau is the only uh, nation that's unmelanated. You know, that's that's called being leprous. Yeah, he, that's a leper. That goes within the law. If you was yeah. a leper and Esau was a clean leper, man, you you was outside the camp, man. Yeah. You was profane, man. Mm -hmm. You know, you was outside the temple at the end of the day, man. Because that was a fucking curse, man, to have fucking leprosy right. at the end of the damn day, man. All right? You know? Mm -hmm. Showing you, you know what I'm saying, you got you got the king of curse, man. Represents Cain, which is that wicked one. Yeah. All right? You know what I'm saying? You know? Showing you that you are the wicked, man. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. All right, because you, because, because, because you got you. Most high hit you with that curse of Cain, man. Mm -hmm. That's how we know who the wicked is, man. All right, you fucking devils, man. Mm -hmm. All right, end of the day. But let's get Example Jeremiah. Of that, not Jeremiah. It's a lot. Uh, uh, if you don't go mind, ahead. go ahead. Just, just go make ahead. a quick point. Go ahead, if, fam. Example: you What you were just going into. Yeah, if you got leprosy and you you outside of the camp. Look at uh, Moses' sister, uh, mm -hmm. Miriam. Yeah, there you go. You I know? was thinking about that too. There you mm -hmm. go. There you go. Uh, Miriam, she got hit with that leprosy. She mm -hmm. was outside of the camp. That's man. right. Because 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 uh, Aaron and Moses, said, man, you 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 curse our sister. With, you know what I'm saying? Pretty much. That, that's death right there. Right. She's right. Like she like the dead. Pretty yeah. much, man. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, and whatnot. And also, remember, you know what I'm saying? When you how about your mouth was was showing Moses, hey, I'm with you. All right, you know what I'm saying? You know, oh, yeah. when Yahweh Shah showed him that sign, he said, put your hand in your bosom. Mm -hmm. And his hand turned, you know, he draw his hand out, it was white as snow. White as snow. Yep. But when he put his hand back in his bosom, it turned back his that natural color. Flag. So if you, so, so, so if you, you white yeah. people, you, you the Israelites, how could that be America if you, you already leprosy, man? Your right. hand turned white, it didn't turn back a natural <laughs> color. Yeah. That don't even make any uh, sense, man. Which y'all not white, man. you're red. You're red at the end of the day. You're not white, you're red. Yeah. At the end of the day, you got that old nasty, pale fucking skin <laughs> and shit. That dead skin and yeah. shit. All right, but we can get um. Let's get Revelation two and nine, bro. For sure, kind, Revelation two kind. and nine, bro. It's the book of Revelation, chapter two, and verse nine, and it reads, "I know thy works and tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich." Yeah, man, they're going into Israel right there. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, we are rich because we are rich with the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding right. through the Rakah Kadash that Yahweh Shemayim Shah bestowed upon the elect, man. Mm -hmm. All right, we rich, all right, because we know the promises. All right, the, the laws and the commandments. All right, and we know our true power. Yahweh Bashem is with the nation of Israel. Right, Israel only at the end of the day, Israel and we in probably because of, because we up under these curses, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you know, go ahead, brother. John, it says, "Fear uh, Salaki." Uh, this is uh, Revelation chapter two and verse nine. It says, I know thy works and tribulation and yep. poverty, mm -hmm. but thou art rich. Mm -hmm. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they blasphemy, are Blasphemy, man. Which number straight up, Lies. downright fucking lie, man. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, bro. All right? And you, how about your mouth? I say he know the blasphemy, man. Mm. All right? Of who now? Of them which say they are Jews. Yeah, you, which you so-called damn kites, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you kites, small man. Small hatters. The small hatters, man. All right, you know the wannabes at the end of the damn day. The, 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 uh, yeah, like bro said, the big Gonzo nose, man. You know, <laughs> I'm saying the Gonzo. I'm about to see something else though. God. The Gonzo nose or whatnot. The uh, the culture vultures at the end of the day, man. God, All right? right, you know you, you DJ Vlad, you DJ Vlad, right. bro. Yep. <laughs> what is it? They call him DJ Vlad DJ and shit. Vlad. <laughs> go ahead, bro. God. You know, go ahead. Huh? It says. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews uh -huh. and are not. And are not, man. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You know, you're not. You're not the Jews, man. Yeah. Even though you portraying yourself that you are the people, but you don't fit any of the prophecies, man, at the end of the day, man. Right. All right? You know? So showing you, you know, but straight up fucking liars at the end Lies. of the day, man. Go ahead, brother. But are the synagogue of Satan. Yeah, the synagogue of Satan, man. The head chief, is speaking of you damn kites, man. Mm -hmm. First and foremost, man. At the end of the day. Hey, yeah. let's get Revelation 3 and 9, bro. God. Why is that written in the scripture? It's written, it's written for a reason, man. Yes, sir. All right? Because somebody had fulfilled that prophecy, man. Mm -hmm. All right? You know? Go ahead. It's Revelation 3 and 9. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan. There we go again. Synagogue of Satan, man. Mm -hmm. Synagogue. Head chief, man. Chief house of Satan. Chief house of Satan, man. Mm -hmm. At the end of the damn day, man. Yep. All right? You wannabes. You culture vultures at the end of the day. You're not God's chosen people, man. Yeah. All right? So if you're, not, if you're not God's chosen people, then who the hell are you, man? Yeah. All right? Cause you know what I'm saying? And that's that's what you devils don't want to account for. You ain't want to answer that, man. Because mm -hmm. you know the judgment that comes along with Esau, man. Right. All right? You know Esau sold that birthright. And I'm, I'm talking about the super elite, yeah. man. Yeah. At the end of the day, these regular peon crackers, they don't know what the fuck going on at the end of the day, man. Mm -hmm. All right? They just rely on the Lord, the so-called black man, man. Yeah. That just, hey, man, that just, man, that, that, that ain't no but just a small layer of things, man. Yeah. Be honest with you, bro. You devils got a hell of a lot of You're fucking scratching people. The surface, more, you scratching you know? the surface on that one, man. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you don't know, y'all don't know what y'all future judgment gonna be, man. You don't know y'all about to go in slavery and captivity. That's right. Double until you devils, man. You whoo, you just don't know, man. The mm -hmm. beat down, the, the hell that your ass about to fucking catch, bro. Man. All right, you know? Psh, go ahead, bro. And then you don't know, you, you well, they, they probably do, but they don't know everything to come along with it. They know they losing America. They know they losing their power at yeah. the end of the damn day, bro. Mm -hmm. All right? Go ahead, brother. That's why they're trying to fight for, you know, tying in the prophecy, going into the civil war. 
You know, they're going to try to fight to, you know, uphold their, their little kingdom that's crumbling, man. Man, they're going to fight, man. They're going to fight. They're going to be for nothing at the end of the damn day, bro. Mm -hmm. It's waste of fucking energy. Right. <laughs> nah, they're fulfilling Except prophecy. They're yeah. fulfilling prophecy, man. Mm -hmm. You know, because y'all about your mouth shot love a good fight at the end of the day, bro. That's right. You know, even though there ain't going to be no fight when it comes to y'all about your mouth shot, nah, man. It'll be all. straight fucking slaughter, bro. You got it, bro. Man. Revelation 3 and 9. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan... Which say they are Jews and are not. And are not, man. Who Who's saying that they are the people, man? We know. Yeah. All right? Who's over there today in the land of Israel claiming our nationality, man? Israelis. All right? Even over, you know, even in the States, man. You know, and they be up there, got these little stupid-ass commercials oh, over five or six hundred, you know what I'm saying, of ish people has been discriminated and yeah. had hate crimes committed against them. And they fucking lies, man. Lies. All these fucking goddamn lies, man. Mm -hmm. The devil's gonna get it in the kingdom, man. Oh, yeah. You're gonna get it in the fucking kingdom, man. Mm -hmm. All right? You're you gonna know what goddamn a motherfucking hate crime is gonna be in the kingdom, bro. Right. All right? You no damn defamation lead in the damn kingdom, bro. Mm -hmm. Going upside your fucking head, man. Knocking your head off your shoulders, man. Right. All right? You, you, don't, you wanna block out the sun, we're gonna throw you up on the fucking sun, man. Mm. Let your ass melt, man. All right, turning the liquid and shit, bro. Yeah. Then put the spirit back on your fucking body, man. Mm. All right, you know what I'm saying? You know, and get your ass back in the fucking field, man. God. All right, you're going to know the meaning of a thousand deaths, man. Yes, All right, we're going to terrorize you. Hey, we're going to put Satan on you motherfuckers too, bro. Mm. All right? Devil's got a lot of motherfucking nerve, man. All right? going to be, like scripture said, going to be doubling to you, devil, Double. man. We ain't going to show no mercy, man. What that, what that James 2 and 13? Mm -hmm. All right? He shall be judged with no mercy that show no show mercy no at the end of the day, bro. Mm. I'm gonna feel sorry for you crackers, man. All right. You got it, bro. This is Revelation 3 and 9. It says, Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, mm -hmm. but do lie. Mm -hmm. But Be do lie. Yeah. Hey, hey, going back to Psalms 58 and 3. Yeah. The natural born motherfucking liars, Speaking bro. Lies, man. They, they, their whole kingdom is built off of fucking lies and shit, yeah. bro. All right. That's why, you know what I'm saying? Yahweh Bashim Al Shah, you know what I'm saying? Starting with Elder Albert Bivens, on to our Elder Apostles today. All right, on down to the elder bitch, on down to us, man. Mm -hmm. Exposing you motherfucking devils, pulling you devils skirt up, man. That's right. All right, and we, really what they're doing is taking brick by brick off you, you know, destroying you damn devils fucking kingdom spiritually, man. Mm -hmm. How about Shemar Shai, you know what I'm saying? He, 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 he gonna come with that goddamn fire, man. Yeah. And you blow it and, and, you know what I'm saying, set it off, man. Mm. Set it off, man. Not, 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 not how Boosie talking about. He gonna really set it off. Fuck yeah. Boosie, man. Fuck little Boosie, man. Yeah. That wicked ass nigga. Shit, he said F the most high. Yeah, yeah, man. He gonna get burned burn. up too. He yeah. get burned up too, man. Yeah. Old diabetes ass motherfucker. He gonna get it too, man. Yeah, for sure. Old sickly looking ass nigga, man. <laughs> you know, you got it, brother. Grimly. Yeah, old black crusty grimly, man. <laughs> You got it, bro. This is Revelation 3 and 9. In the latter, it says, Behold, I will make them to come and worship before thy feet. Yeah, you goddamn Edomites, bro. Mm -hmm. All right? So, no, it ain't time to, you know what I'm saying, to have Edomites kiss on your damn boots and shit, yeah. bro. They ain't, they ain't doing shit, man. Y'all about your I told us to go out there and prophesy, man. Not right. to have Edomites kiss on your damn boots, man. At the end of the day, That's man. That's in vain. That's in vain. Yeah, if you, like El Apostle Tahar said, you ain't got no Rothschilds kissing your boots, then... He ain't doing shit, bro. Yeah. You know, at the end of the damn day. And plus, when well, he kissing your boots and you still in slavery, you still in fucking captivity, man. Your ass still got to fucking clock in on this damn devil right. clock, man, the next right. fucking day, bro. All right? Like you devil's doing something, man. All right? You know, you talking about you black devil. No, nah, Yeah, man. yeah, yeah. Jake want to do shit for fucking show and shit, yeah. bro. And then they might even be, either, either might so proud, they ain't gonna even kiss your feet no fucking way, mm -hmm. man. Unless they got a fucking foot fetish or some shit. They fucking shit. freaks. But outside of that, it might be goddamn Jake's, man. Mm -hmm. That think that they fucking eat them ice at the end of the day, man. Yeah, yeah. All right, you know? That's remorseful. Gentiles. Not knowing that they, their nationality goes back to Israel because they're Israelite foreigners. Because you're going to have Jake, not all Israel, going to come back looking like Israel. Not right. all Israel going to be looking like me and my brother here, bro. Right, Like right. a like a, uh, a regular Israelite, bro. Mm -hmm. All right, you're going to have Jake. They're going to be looking like the scattered. other fucking nations, man. Yeah. The scattered Israelite foreigners, man. Mm -hmm. Like we just said earlier, Jake is scattered throughout the four corners amongst all the nations at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. All right? Like, how about your mouth? Should I say My heritage is like a spectacle bird. bird at yeah. the end of the day, bro. Look at a spectacle bird, man. A bird has, what, many, many different colors, man. Mm -hmm. Many colors, man, of feathers and whatnot. Ain't the same colors of feathers and shit. Yeah. All right? His whole body's co covered with different colors, bro. Yeah. All right? You know, and that's how Israel is, man. Uh -huh. That's why John Rubley couldn't even rely, couldn't recognize, recognize certain Israelites, bro. Yeah. All right? I mean, you take a, a, a Israelite from back then, in the days of old, and look at Jake now. They wouldn't recognize us as Israel, mm -hmm. man. Mm -hmm. How Jake acting out here? Yeah, man, that's why yeah. they they basically a damn heathen. Hey, look at Jake. That you know what I'm saying. The, the, the uh, Jake that the Jake that was Hellenized, man. 
You know, during the time we, we know with Paul, oh, yeah. his ministry was to the Israelite foreigners, man. Mm -hmm. All right, and we do Israelite foreigners, with Gentiles, which we're speaking of Israelite foreigners. Yep. You have you have two definitions of Gentiles. You have Gentiles, the Israelite foreigners, and then you have the other set of Gentiles, which are represents the heathen nations, man. Yeah. All yeah. right, but you got to know what context is speaking of when it's written in the scriptures. When it go into Gentiles, anything pertaining pertaining to gent, it is no different between a Jew and a Greek. Mm -hmm. and that's all my ears, right? Talking about no damn uh, Jew and a fucking cracker, man. Yeah. These dummies out here, man. Yeah. Hey, Psalms one forty seven nineteen and twenty told you that you know what I'm saying this word, word of truth only for it. Israel. Yeah. And then if and if salvation is open for Esau, you clowns don't fucking understand. What Obadiah one eighteen talking about? It's ain't gonna be no nobody remaining in the house of fucking Esau, man. At the end of the day, so how can an Edom might be saved, man? You niggas, so you err not knowing the scriptures, bro. The scriptures. You err not knowing the scriptures, man. Yep. Calling you stupid is a compliment for some of you clowns out there, <laughs> man. Y'all, y'all, y'all beyond stupid, man. Yep. But um, you had something, my brother. Can I have a quick, quick. Go ahead, up. go ahead, fam. It's go going ahead, into what we're going into dealing with the Israelite foreigners. This is James chapter one and verse one. It says, James, a servant of Yahweh oh, Shai, great, great and of the of uh, Slaket. James, a servant of Yahweh and of the Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, to the twelve tribes which are scattered abroad. Greeting. There you go. There you You've been go. Scattered man. all over. There you go. Bro. You know, and, and that goes. How much more today? That was back then. How much more today, bro? Right. Right. Yeah, because you know we've been scattered from uh, one end of the earth. To the other, yeah. Most I said, the utmost parts, utmost parts of the world, which represents Babylon. Yep. They're talking about the whole Babylon. world, man. Yep. Represents the whole world at the end of the day, bro. Mm -hmm. In the way you gonna go at where there's not a Hebrew Israelite at the end of the day, man. Yeah. All right, you know. That's a mystery. That's right. You that's know? one. That's one of the mysteries, one bro. The mystery. Yeah. Uh, matter of fact, you get um, Nahum three and one, bro. God. You know, go ahead and get in the scriptures of the. Or the light, man. That light coming in was yes, representing sir. reason I was understanding, man. Mm -hmm. We had we had to prove why the light had to come into the world, man. Because yeah, yeah. Esau, because Yahweh Shemal Shalav, Esau, this damn devil, he had to fulfill his prophecy. He had to rule, mm -hmm. all right? The beast had to be healed so he can go ahead and see the whole earth with lies. Yeah. Fill it up with darkness, man. Yeah. Gross darkness, man. Mm -hmm. All right? Gross darkness to people. Gross darkness okay. to people. We ain't even all finished right. that one. Yeah. We, oh, we still ain't finished? Okay. Well, uh -huh. well, matter of fact, matter of fact, if you get a Nahum 3 and that? 1, yeah, yeah, let's finish that up then, by the uh -huh. This yeah. is Isaiah chapter 60 and verse 2. It says, For behold. And hey, we going into light. And look, how about your mouth shot? It was raining. Light, now the light man. coming. Yeah. Come on, man. How about your mouth shot? Beautiful, man. Oh, uh, you know, Lord. You know, I'm going to have light in, inside the title. You know, and here it is. You know, we were part. It was raining. It was raining heavier than the mug just a few man. moments ago. Man. And I tell him, brother, hey, man, make sure we, you know, we project our voice, man. You know, yeah. the rain coming down hard on the damn car and shit. Yeah. So they want to drown us out. And look, how about your mouth shot? I got the light peeping out, man. Mm -hmm. Beautiful man, go Life ahead, my brother. Yes, man. sir. Yes, sir, brother. This is Isaiah sixty and two. It says, "For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth, mm -hmm. and gross darkness the people." You can speak on it, brother. Yep, and that's these people being covered in lies, man. You know the the lies that of Esau Edom that he's pushed throughout the four corners of the earth, man. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, come pushed to the four corners of the earth, starting here in Babylon the Great, man. This mm -hmm. is that that uh, that golden cup. You know, have, that have made the nations drunk. Right. You got right. you got uh, heathen nations that don't even call themselves by their biblical names no right. more. They right. falling after the way of Esau, man. They, right. That covering cast. Right. You're right. You no. Know, it says, but the Lord Yahweh Shemal Shai shall arise upon thee, and His glory shall be seen upon mm. thee. You know, mm. speaking it to this truth. You know, the Lord called us. We're the light of the world, man. Mm. Oh, know? I got that. I got yeah, that. Yeah, and that, that's ahead, with bro. us having this truth, man. Because mm. we're not only out here speaking, you know, the word of the Lord, you know, spreading this light. Hey, we're actually living this thing, man. That's right, brother. That's you know? right. That's most importantly, bro. Yeah. Because you got you got to let your light shine amongst men. How you going to let your light shine amongst men? Right. You know what I'm saying? That show you can't just be a hearer of this word. You got to be a doer as well, too. You that's know, that right. light, wisdom, knowledge, understanding, man. Mm -hmm. All right, all these scriptures, bro. Yep. You know, it can be given. Through the inspiration of Yahweh Bashimi Yahweh at the end of the day, through the Rakal Kadash, bro. That's right. You know? That's right. So, you know what I'm saying? So, you can't just know these scriptures, bro, all right, and know the breakdowns, know the mysteries, and know how to teach. Mm -hmm. That's part of it, you know? Yep. But you also, it's, it's it's all in vain if you're not applying Lying it and you're not it. living it, bro. Right. All right? You got to be living it too, man. That's right. All right? That's right. Faith without works is dead at the end of the day, man. That's right. All right? You know, hey, going back to Second Edges 9 and 7. Mm -hmm. All right, the elect they're gonna get delivered, and they're gonna they're gonna they're gonna get delivered, Save and they're gonna the escape works. by their works, man. Mm -hmm. Escape what? That judgment, that second death, man. That fire, mm -hmm. man. Thermonuclear fire, man. Yep. All right, the Yahweh Shemal Shah is gonna bring over here to Babylon, that destroying wind. Yeah. Two hundred million, man. All right, courtesy of thermonuclear missiles, man. Yep. All right. Via World War Three. World War Three. That's, That's right. right. That's right. All right. Well, we, um, 
You go back at Nahum 3 and 1 now. Yep, 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 yep. This is Nahum chapter 3 and verse 1. Woe to the bloody city. Yeah. Woe to the bloody city, man. Mm -hmm. Speak on it, brother. You God, woe on going it. into destruction, man. Mm -hmm. That's all tied into prophecy, man. You know, that this bloody city, America, is going to be destroyed, man. That's right. That's you know, right. it's already forespoken. It says, woe to the bloody city. It is all full of lies. All full of lies, man. Mm -hmm. I wonder why, man. Why it's full of lies, man. Yeah. You got the wicked that's fucking ruling, man, at the end of the day, bro. Yep. Go figure, man. It's full of mm -hmm. lies at the end of the day. All right? That's why it's, it's hit with gross darkness, man. Yep. Because Jake don't know whether they going or coming at the end of the day. They don't know that salvation is nearer than what they believe. Yeah. They don't know that that solar eclipse was a major, major sign. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Showing, going back to Romans 13, 11, salvation is nearer than what we believe. That's man. right. All right, it's high time to wake out of sleep because salvation is nearer than what we believe, man. That's right. All right, the men of the Lord, hey, we ain't sleep. We on our watch, man. Mm -hmm. we, we, you know what I'm saying? We, we, ain't, we ain't in no darkness, man. Yeah. We the children of the light, man. Oh, yeah, there's another one, Children of the Light. Of the we, ain't, we ain't Children of the Darkness, man, at the end of the day. That's right. I represent the fucking world, man. Going to mm -hmm. represent Esau. All right, you know? God. You got it, bro. Back in that Nahum 3 and 1, it says, Woe to the bloody city. It is all full of lies and robbery. Mm -hmm. The prey departeth not. Yeah, because he ain't got he ain't got a judgment yet, man. All right? right. Man, how about your mouth trying to bring judgment in? Bought his ass into slavery and captivity. All right? He ain't take his ass out of fucking power yet. So he's still fulfilling a couple of last seconds while he's in fucking power, man. Mm -hmm. All right, doing his wickedness. He still got to bring in that one world order. All right, he got to bring in us in that Karagma on the left hand side through the power of Yahweh Bashim Al Bashar. Mm -hmm. All right, you know, he have to turn the fight once the nations are fighting against each other. Everybody turn on the fucking whore. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? What they going to look to turn to what? You know, fight against Yahweh Bashar, which is going to be a fucking rap, man. Right. Yahweh Bashar going to finish all you fucking nations up, bro. Right. All right, all y'all going to have a big ass. Motherfucking L, man. Mm. All right, you know it's gonna be a straight sweep, man. Yep. All right, you ain't gonna you ain't get you ain't get you ain't get no dub. You ain't get no wins, man. <laughs> right? When it comes to your about your mouth shot, man. Man, you fight right. against the power that created the earth, created us. You know, he he created everything, and you gonna fight against uh that power? Man, most of if you wanted to, and just by you know what I'm saying blink of an eye, man. All you heathens can be destroyed, bro. Yeah. In the blink of a fucking eye, man. All right? Ain't enough for y'all about your mouth shot to raise Israel back up. All right. Quick, fast, in a hurry, man. Mm -hmm. But, hey, the y'all about your mouth shot bound by his words, though. That's right. At the end of the day. That's so right. Prophecy is going to fulfill, man. Mm -hmm. Y'all about your mouth shot, he put his word above himself, man. That's right. That's right. All right, you know? So, you know what I'm saying? So, he bound by his words. Mm -hmm. um, we are finished with that Nahum 3 and 1. God. Yeah, All right, man. We go ahead. Go ahead, brother. Now, you go ahead, fam. Kai, go ahead, I'm not sure ahead. if you got this or not. But this is uh, First Thessalonians. Chapter 5 and verse 5. I quoted it. God. Go ahead, man. That's the spirit. The spirit yes, wanted it brought out, man. So that going to subway right into, because we almost about to wrap it up. Okay. That going to subway, you know what I'm saying, into, you know what I'm saying, um, the scriptures going into and representing, you know what I'm saying, the light. You know, represent this knowledge and the truth, which is only given through mm -hmm. Yahweh Bashim Abushai, and it's given through his men, man. All right? right. The elect men of Israel. All That's right. right. The elect. Kind. You got it, bro. It says, 1 Thessalonians 5 and 5. It says, ye are all the children of the light. And that's going into the elect of Israel, the one-third. Mm -hmm. And starting with the 144,000, man. Yep. All right, men, man. All right, 12,000 men out of each respectful tribe of the nation of Israel, mm -hmm. which accumulate to 144,000, which is the body government, Yahweh Bashem al That's right. All right. That's right. Okay, you got it, my brother. It says, and the children. And that chief cornerstone is Yahweh man. Yahweh yep. Followed by, followed by King David. Count. Followed by the rest of the 12. Yep. All right. And going down to the rest of the 144,000. Mm -hmm. All right. That's right. It says, starting it over, 1 Thessalonians 5 and 5, ye are all children of the light and the children of the day. Mm -hmm. We are not of the night mm -hmm. nor of darkness. Yeah, that's Esau, man. All right. And these other heathen nations, though, but mainly speaking of Esau. Yeah. All right. And you know, two thirds, you you counted as the wicked man. Yahweh Shah said you just like your father the devil. Mm. So you know what I'm saying? That plot of you two third niggas on the side as well, too. The scriptures say, no hand joining hand with the wicked. The wicked shall not go unpunished. Man. Yeah. All right, you know? That's a heavy quote because, mm -hmm. you know, Yahweh Shah finishing that. You know, he said uh he was a liar, he's a liar and a father of it. Mm -hmm. You know, Esau, yeah. Yeah, dealing with Sleazy E, man. Sleazy E, man. Going all the way back to Cain. Yeah. You know, remember what Cain told, you know what I'm saying? When you, when, when Yahweh asked Cain, man, what, where's your brother Abel? Yeah. He, he, he was acting he stupid, man. He yeah. lied, man. I ain't the way. I'm my mom's brother's keeper. Same I'm not my spirit. brother's keeper, you know? Yeah. Same wicked ass spirit coming back, man. Mm hmm. You know? Really going back into the garden when he was a serpent. Oh, yeah. Lying yep. and deceiving ass, man. Mm hmm. All right. Scripture tell you more subtle than all the rest of the beasts of the, beast of the field, man. Mm -hmm. Esau, man. 
But you got it, bro. Con. First Thessalonians 5 and 6. Therefore, let us not sleep. As do others, mm -hmm. but let us watch and yeah, be cause, sober. Yeah, because that means you sleep, man. That means you in fucking pure dark, darkness. Mm -hmm. Cause you know what I'm saying? Because what you're supposed to be doing, we, we don't supposed to be giving you how about your mouth a shot, no rest, man. Right. All right. You're supposed to be coming out of the ways of, of Babylon, the mindset, the mentality of Babylon, all the customs of fucking Babylon. You're supposed to be coming out of Babylon, repent and returning back to your how about your mouth a shot. That's right. And keeping the laws, statute, commandments to the best of your ability mm -hmm. at the end of the day or whatnot, man. Yep. All right. You know, that's what we're supposed to be doing. All right, you're supposed to be doing that daily, man. Yeah, ain't no two or three days out of the fucking week, man. You supposed to do that shit every day, bro. Yeah, you're supposed to be living it, man. It's a lifestyle. All right, it's a lifestyle at the end of the day, man. All right, you got it. Kind. Uh, you want to keep going? You, you can read a little bit more on that. Read a little bit more on that. This is First Thessalonians five and seven. It says, "For they that, for they that sleep, sleep in the night, and they that be drunken are drunken in the night." Hey, man, that's Jake, man. Going back. You know, two third niggas going back like the uh, in Matthew twenty four. I think that Matthew twenty four. So. Nah, I don't think that's Matthew twenty four. Where it should be like the days of Noah. Yeah, that's know? Matthew. That Matthew twenty four. Okay, yeah. come on, I was correct. Okay, Matthew twenty four would be like days of Noah, mm -hmm. man. And we're we gonna be doing partying. Yep. Giving it to marriage, and man. Giving it marriage. Bullshitting at the end of the day, man. Living yep. it up, man. Sleep, man. Mm -hmm. All right, not knowing how close we are for the return of. You know what I'm saying? Our big bro Yahweh shot through the power of Yahweh, man. Right. Not 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 having the spirit of discerning, and knowing that, hey man, we about to come into the time of Jacob's trouble, man. Some very, very troubled times like never ever before, man. Right. Ain't number one Jacob's trouble at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. All right, you know? Do, do do we have a lot of great mourning of our history, a lot of great death and plagues? All right, you know what I'm saying? We we done been through some we been been through some been through hell, man. Mm -hmm. But all that hell we done been through as a people. All the losses we suffer as a people, going into slavery, going into captivity, all right? All that lamentation we done been through as people, all right? Ain't that compared to Jacob's trouble, bro. Not gonna compare. Like El Pastor Hart said, ain't number one Jacob's trouble at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. You know? You got it, bro. That's why I said it's a time like no other. Right. It about to be great death, man. Hey, man, it's most high. He bringing his wrath and his vengeance, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's the angriest you how about your mouth shot ever been, man. So angry, the scripture tell you the earth shall shake to and fro. Mm. To and fro, I tell you, the mighty men shall be... The mighty men shall become like women, man. All right? That's how much hell you have about your mouth shot about the brain in this place, bro. That's right. All right? You got it, my brother. That's right. That's right. This ain't no play thing at the end of the fucking day, bro. Ain't no Dang. play thing, man. You got it, bro. This is 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 and verse 8. It says, But let us who are of the day be sober, putting on the breastplate, breastplate of faith and love, mm -hmm. and, and for an helmet, the hope, of salvation mm -hmm. you know good. relying on you know putting all our eggs in one basket mm -hmm. having faith in Yahweh Hashem Al Shai that when Yahweh Shai comes Lord will we be of that number to receive that salvation man that's the only way out of here man that's right that's right that's, that's the right. only way out of here that's right you, you know you know the spirit has been putting on Esau to make all these movies and these shows dealing with uh, nuclear destruction you're not gonna survive nuclear destruction here nah, in Babylon the nah, Great. Nah, nah, hell no. Nah. Rick that, Ross that's trying that's to build a damn bunker. He's in darkness. Well, I'm gonna turn him in lemon pepper, man. <laughs> lemon pepper. He'll, right. He'll be a lemon pepper wing and shit, man. Right. At the end of a uh, lemon a uh, lemon pepper plate at the end of the fucking day, man. Exactly. All right. Along with the other clowns out there, man. Mm -hmm. You know, there ain't no escaping, ain't no escaping the judgment of y'all about Shmuel Bashar, bro. Yeah. All right. Those that mark for death, hey man, death is gonna come and it's gonna fucking find your ass, bro. That's right. Ain't no escaping judgment of y'all about Shmuel Bashar, man. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Um, finishing out, it says First Thessalonians five and nine. For Yahweh, by Shem Shai, have not appointed us to wrath. Uh, talking mm -hmm. about you, hopeful elect, man. Mm -hmm. You know, you ain't appointed to the wrath of Yahweh by Shem Shai because you're getting in order right now, man. Mm -hmm. You're walking in the light of the Lord right now, man. And it's truth. Mm -hmm. All right, but for these two thirds, hey, this is um, this is a day reserved unto their judgment, uh, a perdition of ungodly men, as it says in uh, 2 Peter 3 and verse 9, man. Mm -hmm. Nope. Let me uh, make sure I got that correct first. You know, I don't want to uh, mislead none. Mm -hmm. Second Peter's uh, three, oh, Salak, verse seven, Salak. It says, "But the heavens and the earth, which are now by the same word, are kept in store, reserved unto fire against the day of judgment and perdition of ungodly men." Talking about two thirds, man. This day is reserved unto the wicked ass two thirds. Uh, Esau, Edom. You know, and these heathen nations, man. 
All right, but as for us, as we're reading, that wrath is not unto us, man. Not for the hopeful elect, Lord, will we be of that number? Okay. It's it. Okay. Oh, scripture tell you the uh, righteous shall scarcely make it, bro. Yeah, scarcely be saved. Barely, barely yeah. make it, bro. Yep. All right. So how much more for the ungodly, man? Mm-hmm. Go ahead, bro. First Thessalonians five and nine. It says, "For Yahweh have not appointed us to wrath, but to obtain salvation by our Lord, uh, obtain salakit." But to obtain salvation by our Lord, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. So that's how we're going to get the victory, man. Through having faith in Yahweh Shai, man. That the blood of Yahweh Shai covers us, man. Lord will. That's right. That's right. Okay. Man, let's get, um, let's get to represent, you know, I'm showing you that the light. Because we show you the damn fucking devil. Mm -hmm. The wicked devil that he is or whatnot. You know what I'm saying You know And we're going into The title The light Which represents the truth Knowledge and understanding man. That Yahweh Shema was shy That light is going You know what I'm saying Going, going to pierce the fucking darkness At the end of the day Or whatnot right. man Alright you know And then we, and then we're going to see Oh That's Esau right there Behind them damn curtains man Alright yeah. Pulling all the strings Or whatnot straight. man Orchestrating everything Oh yeah That's the fucking devil Right there mm -hmm. man When the light When the light hit man You know you ain't no fucking Jaffin You eat them ice bro <laughs> yeah. Fucking eat them ice man Right all right, that's why they hate the light, man. Mm -hmm. Let me get um, let me get Psalms ninety-seven, Psalms ninety-seven, and read verse eleven and twelve, man. Let's just prove that God. this light, the light represents the wisdom, knowledge, understanding, man. God. All right, and only the righteous gonna be able to obtain the light of Yahweh by Shema So let's get a, we gonna get a couple of scriptures to prove that, man. That's right. And we don't need it but a couple of them, man. Mm -hmm. I can get one, and that gonna Guess drop so the mic, yeah, but yeah. nah, man. But you know, we're gonna lead up to that one, though. Yeah, <laughs> we're yeah, gonna fade out for last. Kind. Go ahead, Barbecue Show. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 97, and verse 11. It says, Light is is sown for the righteous. What? Uh, it's sown for who? who? Light is sown for the righteous. All right, which is the elect of Israel, man. Yeah. All right, so I'm with the elect, bro. That's you right, it, bro. And gladness for the upright in heart. Mm. Mm -hmm. Rejoice in the Lord Yahweh Shemal Shai, ye righteous, mm -hmm. and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. Yeah, and then we give thanks, man, every day, bro. Every day, man. Yeah. All right. We can't give thanks enough at the end of the day. Mm -hmm. All right, because Yahweh Shai didn't have, didn't have to bestow his light upon us. He could have left us up there in, in complete darkness, man. Yeah. Pure darkness at the end of the day, not knowing who we are, not knowing our true power, mm -hmm. not knowing what time we is, not knowing how, not knowing the measure of the time according to prophecy, of knowing that we just that much more close. Where Yahweh Shah is gonna return, the doors of mercy and grace are gonna be shut. Right. All right. You know what I'm saying? And hey, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just having that light and understanding, knowing the mysteries. Yeah. Man, that's a blessing. That's mercy within the sub because it's it not given to all of Israel, man. It is. It's only given to um. Matter of fact, Hopefully give me that. um. Give give me um. Matthew real quick. Got thirteen nine. Matthew thirteen nine and ten. Yeah, Matthew thirteen nine and ten. God. It's the book of Saint Matthew, chapter thirteen. And verse 9, and it reads, Who have ears to hear, let him hear. Mm -hmm. And the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? Yeah, in parables. So, Yahweh Shem was shy when he was going into the scriptures and breaking it down. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He was only breaking it down, and his word was only given to the elect, man. It wasn't given to all of Israel. That's right. That's why the disciples asked the Lord, Why are you, why you speaking in parables? Asking Yahweh Shah, Why are you speaking in parables? You know, which is a riddle or a dark meaning or a dark saying at the end of the day is not meant, you know what I'm saying? It's not convey for everybody to get it, everybody understand. So they're asking right. that question, and Yahweh Shah is going to break it down too. Mm -hmm. All right? You got it, bro. Verse 11. It's like, it's like St. John 17 and 9. Mm -hmm. Yahweh Shah said, I pray for, I pray pray for, for them. them. All right. I not pray not for the not world, for the world but, mm -hmm. but I pray for them. Yeah. That world represents what? Israel. Yeah. So Yahweh Shah, Yahweh Shah was showing you that he only praying. For the elect of elect. Israel, not even all of Israel, only yeah. the elect of Israel, man. Mm. All right. So what the hell these heathen nations get in that, bro? Yeah. If if you how about you, my ain't praying for all Israel? How the hell these heathen nations the fit they in that? Yeah, bro. Go ahead, my brother. Go ahead. Uh. This is Take air, air, not Matthew knowing the scriptures, the scriptures man. Yeah. You niggas, air, not knowing the scriptures. You got it, barbecue show. This is Saint Matthew chapter thirteen and verse eleven. He answered and said unto them. Because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom. The of mysteries, heaven. the mysteries. Yeah. I thought the Lord loved everybody, brother. All right. All right. You know what I'm saying? But yet, why Yahweh Bashima was shy? He only given his knowledge and understanding to the elect. This word and truth ain't for everybody, man. Yeah. Everybody can't go into the scriptures and understand the scriptures, bro. All right. You know what I'm saying? Know your big mama. No, she don't know the scriptures, mm -hmm. bro. At the end of the day, man. <laughs> you know, call on some damn Christ and Jesus. You're a woman anyway. Yeah, Probably a woman any goddamn way, bro. Yeah. All right. You know, you can't go to Esau Seminary. 
a theologian school and be ordained minister and thinking you a man of the Lord. No. Right. Right. Yeah, how about Shemal Shah have to ordain you going back to St. John 15 and 16, bro? Mm. You can't choose your how about Shemal Shah. The most I gotta so choose you. you. Yeah. Let them get it. St. John 15 and 16. You can read it for yourself, man. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Yep. Go ahead, bro. You know, it also ties into Amos 3 and 7. Mm -hmm. You know, the Lord will do nothing but reveal the secrets to the servants, the, the prophets, prophets man. Right. That's right. That's right. That's right. So bro. this truth is only for the hopeful elect. Man. That's it, man. That's it, bro. The one third, man. That's right. it, bro. All right. You got it. This is the book of St. Matthew, chapter 13, and verse 11. He answered and said unto them, Because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, yeah. but to them it is not A given. mystery. What is a mystery? Something that's unknown at unknown. the end of the day. Yeah. That's why Jake, they still walking in fucking darkness, man. Mm -hmm. Only the legs is going to have that light, all right? It was Yahweh Shemar Rashad going in too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The mysteries, which is only made known to the elect men. Right. Yahweh Shemar Rashad, man. That's right. All right, you know? Of course, you have the lake woman too, but at the end of the day, you know, we're talking about the prophets, men of the Lord. Start with man. the men. Start, start with the men. The Everything starts with the men because the kingdom begins within the men anyway. Yeah. All right, you know? Mm -hmm. You got it, bro, because you, your nationality is determined through who? Men. Yep. All right, numbers 1 and 18. That's why the elders apostles always go into, you know, do we need a Hebrew like woman to bring back the nation? No. Mm -hmm. We can have the women of the other nations to bring back Israel at the end of the day, man. Mm -hmm. All right? Showing the insignificant, man. That, that some of these damn women think any more than what the hell they really are, man. That's right. All that's right? right. It's beautiful when the woman is in order, man. When you talk about the sisters it that is. listen, yeah, yeah. about these damn wicked ass bitches out here, man. Mm -hmm. I can't even call them women these wicked ass bitches, man. It's the difference between a woman yeah. and a bitch at the end of the day. Woman counted as a dog. There so you go. There you go. That's you a go. rifle word. You there know? you go, brother. Yeah, and that's scripture. That's yeah. scripture. Yep. All right. We mm -hmm. got it, bro. You got it, bro. I think that was the point. Yeah, that was the point. Well, to so them, we, it's not given. Yeah, so we go back. You had another precept or something? You I just wanted to get that NLT of that Psalms 97 real go ahead, quick. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. This is uh, Psalms 97 and 11 in the NLT. It says, light shines on the godly and joy on those whose heart are right. So only this truth is going to uh, fall upon the hopeful elect, man. Mm -hmm. You know, those are the godly. Those are the ones serving Yahweh by Shemiah was shy. Mm -hmm. It says, verse 12, may all who are godly rejoice in the Lord, Yahweh Shemel Shai, and we do, man. Mm -hmm. You know, we give all praise to Yahweh Shemel Shai for giving us this light, this truth, man, this wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. It says, and praise his holy name, okay? Showing you the importance of the name, man. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why I wanted to get that version because the name of Yahweh Shemel Shai is of this truth, man. man that's, a, that's one of the major keys right there. You got to yeah. know the name of Yahweh Shemel Shai. That's right. You're going to be a man of the Lord and you don't know his name, bro. Yeah. All right? Um, let's get Psalms 119. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, I'm going to get two verses out of Psalms 119. We're going to get Psalms 119, verse 105, man. 105, not 105. 105, man. 105. Uh, that's one of the longest chapters in this yep. book. Really. Yep. Yep. This is, uh, excuse me. This is Psalms 119 to 105. Yeah. And 105, it says, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet. Thy word is thy lamp to thy feet. Hey, mm -hmm. man, when you got a lamp, what you got in that lamp, man? You got the oil, you got the fuel. You know what I'm saying? What, the, what, the, the show that light, right? Yeah. To have that light, man. Yeah. Gotta have that fuel. Light bro. your path. Yeah. You know? That oil. Gotta have that oil. The oil. That oil. Yep. Ooh, yep. Ooh, that yep. oil, baby. Yes, sir. There you go, baby. Yes, sir. Go. Because once when we was out the, without this truth, this light, man, we was walking aimlessly in the world. You know, that's right. We were doing a bunch of nigga shit. Yep. You know, whatever uh, lies Esau, you know, whether you want to be a fucking thug or you know, just uh, you think for the rest of your life you just gonna be a damn NBA player or some mm -hmm. shit. You know, whatever you thought you had going on, you know, mm -hmm. based off uh, Esau's lies in this world. Hey, we were, we was walking out of the way of that light, man. Yeah, we was in the congregation of the dead, bro. Yeah. All right, we're walking in complete darkness, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you got it, bro. It says, thy word is a lamp unto my feet, and thy light, and a light unto my path. A uh, what? And a light unto my Brother path. Representing this truth, man. Yeah. Representing this truth, man. Knowing how to walk, knowing how to move. Yep. All right, knowing how to be in this fucking world, man. Having mm -hmm. the spirit of discernment, man. Of what's good and what's evil, according to Yahweh Shem Shah, going back to the scriptures, laws, right. and commandments. That's man. right. Knowing what's pleasing to Yahweh Shem Shah, man. Mm -hmm. All right. So we walking in that light, bro. Yeah. We ain't walking in no fucking darkness at the end of the day, man. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, jump down to verse one thirty. God, this is Psalms one nineteen and one thirty. Verse one thirty, it says, "The entrance of thy words giveth light." 
Woo! Showing you that rep represent this truth, bro. Yeah. Represent this truth, man. That yeah. true light at the end of the day, bro. God. All right, we we the true illuminated ones at the end of the day. Starting with, you know what I'm saying? How about your mouth shot first and foremost, man? Right. All right. Down to his men, man. We the true illuminary ones, man. Mm -hmm. Illuminated ones, man. We 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 the Luciferians. Niggas niggas yeah. will bug out when we say that. Yeah. They don't even know what Luciferian means. Lucifer means, man. Yeah. All right. Light shit. barriers. Light barriers. Yep. Bro. All right. The morning star, bro. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. You got it, fam. It says, the entrance of thy words giveth light. It giveth understanding unto the simple. Is what? It giveth understanding unto the simple. It giveth understanding to the simple. I mean, we yeah. all was simple yeah, at one was. time, man. It was. Until y'all about put a light upon us, man. Like you say, we walking in the world. We we uh, thinking, you you know, you'd be a big time NBA player. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get this money, dog. Whatever I do, I'm going to get the bag, man. Yeah. Trying to get rich and shit in your hell at the end of the day. Right. All right. You know what I'm saying? You know? And... And like they had that famous saying in the world, man. You know, you want to make uh, Yahweh Shema laugh. Tell All right, tell him plans. your plans at the end of the day, bro. Yeah, yeah. All right, we we couldn't we couldn't foresee us prophesying and doing what we doing right now. All right, 15, 20 years ago when we were still blinding in this fucking yeah. world, man. All right, you yeah. know. Thought we'd be an NBA player, big time yeah. rapper and shit. Not knowing all the shit that comes along with it. Yep. I'm glad you how about you? Well, I wouldn't go and fuck with it no way. All the damn wicked ass rituals they be doing and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know. But even more so, you how about you? My shot. Hey, call us, man. Call us to the ministry, Open bro. Our eyes, man. Open our eyes, man. You know what I'm saying? You know. And we was called, and we're praying we are the chosen. We'll right. do it to the end. We'll be the chosen. We gotta endure it to the end, though. That's right. But we answering that call, man. Mm -hmm. All right, we gotta answer that call every fucking day, bro. All right, That's right. to the end. At the end of the day, bro. All right, uh -huh. we pray that we, you know, we get beamed up in them chariots, man. Right. Let's keep that second death, man. Mm -hmm. All right, but you got it, though, brother. Um, jump down. Give me us um, Proverbs six and twenty-three. Come. Okay. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter six, and verse twenty-three. And it reads, "For the commandment is a lamp, mm -hmm. and the law is light." Whoo! The law what? And the law is light. Tell you, man. Tell you, man. That true light, man. Yeah. That true light, bro. All right. Like I say, man, we can we can see so clear. All right. We know what time we in, man. Yeah. We ain't like Jake, Jake in the world. Oh, yeah. You know, it's my little girl. And I'm going to go ahead. And I got my little son here. You know, my, my boy, he's six. And my little girl, she four. And, man, we're going to go ahead. And we're gonna already going to start setting money. You know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. for their college funds and this and that. Man, you in complete fucking darkness. Darkness, bro. man. That's dark. That's how you got a lot of our people mindset and mentality is baby, we're gonna save enough money up, baby. We're gonna do this, do that, so we're gonna be able to take that trip to yeah. da da da. Not knowing, man. Hey, out of right, a hey, year of Jacob Shovel. Hey, man, this shit, man, this shit don't even be here, man. We yeah. pray y'all about your shower and destroy this motherfucker, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? They don't even know America ain't got no five year run don't. to it, bro. All don't. right. You know, at the end of the damn day. Niggas are already planning ahead, five, ten years. What, 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 you know what I'm saying? What's your future goal? What your, what your five year goals? What right, your ten year right. goal? Man, you in complete darkness, darkness. man. Darkness. Ain't trying to think about no five years and no fucking Babylon. Fuck Babylon, bro. Mm -hmm. I pray and hope ain't got no fuck. ain't got no fucking five years, right, bro. Right, right. I ride, 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 ain't got another year in this motherfucker, man. Yeah, yeah. You know? So you gotta, you gotta be in complete darkness to not want judgment bring down on this place man not seeing everything that's going on and knowing that everything linking up with the scriptures we already you know what i'm saying like i say this devil already um giving uh monkeys brain implants and shit yeah it was up there in china china yeah you know giving them brain implants in which you know they always test out it on animals first for people mm -hmm. and they still trying to perfect that goddamn karagma they're still perfecting that goddamn karagma at the end of the day yeah coming in time in uh revelation 13 16 and 17 mm -hmm. where esau gonna mandate that motherfucking technology already here yeah all right you don't know hey esau done put the movies uh civil war which civil war. you know what i'm saying yeah. which we gonna see as a Camp brother here already seen it. All right. He already done seen it already. Yeah, give a little elbow and shit. You know what I'm saying? Out of love though. You know, but we're gonna see it again as a camp, man. Yep. All right. Other brothers already done seen it already. Mm -hmm. Other brothers did commentary on it, but we're gonna see it as a camp at GMS South Carolina Midlands, right. man. Right you know, I'm out of rock the zot, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, we get to see that uh this weekend, bro. That's right, that's right. You know, but um nevertheless, man, our eyes are open where we can see, we see that. this end time prophecies, bro. We measuring the time. We ain't got no but a couple of seconds left in this kingdom, bro. Right. All right, and that's your how about you my shot bestowing that, that that light upon us, man. Yes, we know that this truth ain't a gimmick, man. Mm -hmm. This ain't a play thing, man. That's that light. You got a lot of Jake in the circumcision know that they Israel. They don't just stop with you two third niggas that don't they don't know what the fuck going on. Mm -hmm. That's lost in the world and shit. 
All right, you know what I'm saying? Even you know you damn Jake, which the, the worst of the niggas yeah. that's in the circumcision, bro. Yeah. That, that that's going off and teaching and teaching for filthy lucrative sake. Took that five hundred one c three charter. Took that covenant with Esau. Made that pact with Esau, man. Yeah. All right, Esau. Yeah, yeah. You put that gag all on me. I won't teach. I won't teach that Esau. Right. As long as you got, as long as you got that money coming in, man. Mm -hmm. All right, niggas too, man. Man, hey, you, you you full of darkness, man. Yeah. All right. How much I darkness. got you blinded, bro? Yeah. You got you niggas blinded, man. Or the judgment that's gonna hit your ass, bro. Mm -hmm. It's right there around the corner. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, they they walking in darkness because they still trying to build shop here, trying yeah. to build uh, Hebrew Israelite communities. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, selling out, taking the five hundred one C three for the for mm -hmm. the bag, which yeah. the bag gonna perish. It's about to go digital if you know the prophecy of the MOTB. You know, they still trying to hold on to this 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 queendom that's about to be destroyed, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's well, how you know they walking in dark. They're going to be destroyed along with it, man. Oh, in the, the house of mirth. In the house of mirth, man. They're they, they in for a big rude awakening, man. All right, you have finished that. That's um, Proverbs 6 and 23. You have some more on that. Uh, I have some more you, on that. Go ahead. Bro. This is Proverbs 6 and 23. It says, for the commandment is, is a lamp and the law is light mm -hmm. and reproof of instruction are the way of life. The proof of what? Mm. Instruction. And reproof bro. of instructions. Reproof of instructions, man. Mm -hmm. Reproof, man. Telling you, hey, only the prophets gotta teach you, bro. Yeah. I gotta teach you how to serve you, how about your mouth in truth and in spirit, That's man. That's right. All right. That's right. We didn't know what righteousness and wickedness was. We had to be tight, man. Yeah. Through men of the Lord, man. Going back to Jeremiah 3 and 15. But y'all about your mouth shot, so he's gonna have pastors after his own yeah. heart. And that word heart, go back to law, uh -huh. the Hebrew word law, which mm -hmm. means your mind, man. Yep. All right, that's how you, that's how you gonna be able to understand and know, man, how to how to serve you, how about your mouth with shot in truth and in spirit. Man. That's right. All right. That's right. You gotta have somebody to teach you, man. Mm -hmm. How can you hear this word without a preacher at the end of the day? Yeah. Ain't talking about no damn preacher, uh, preacher Jenkins, Pastor Jenkins and shit, right, man. Right. He's still eating pork and shit. Still in the fucking world, man. Mm -hmm. Still calling on Christ, man. I'm talking about his ass, bro. We it's not talking about him. Yeah. It um, have to be a man that that bears the light, has the truth of Yahweh by Shemel Shai, because the scriptures goes into. Out uh, the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch, man. Right. Let me get Isaiah eight and twenty, Barbara for sure. God. We're almost about we're almost about to wrap it up. God, this is the book of Isaiah, chapter eight, and verse twenty. And it reads mm -hmm. To the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word. Yeah, so you're speaking out of your own vain opinion. Mm -hmm. All right, you saying something. And you quoting something and they don't go back into the scriptures. Yeah. But the Lord love everybody. It ain't, it ain't in the scriptures, bro. Mm -hmm. All right. The Lord, he don't hate nobody. We ain't gonna have no slaves in the kingdom. That's not in the scriptures, bro. Right. You know what I'm saying? You know? Um, the Lord is all love. He good all the time. We, we, we're that in the oh, scriptures, in bro. The scriptures. Ain't in the scriptures, man. Yeah. Ain't gonna be no mark of the beast. There ain't gonna be no Jacob's trouble. Mm -hmm. That's not in the scriptures, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yo? Go ahead, brother. Come on. It says to the law and to the testimony. If oh, the law done away with. The law done away with. Right, right. All right, that's not in the scriptures, bro. Not in the scriptures. All right, those lies right there, you add and take away from the scriptures, bro. Mm -hmm. All right, showing you. Hey, go ahead. Yep. It says to the law and to the testimony, if they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them. Ain't no light in. There we go. That word light, man. Mm -hmm. There ain't no truth in you, no man. Truth. Spirit, how about your mouth shot? Ain't dealing with your ass, bro. Yeah. Let me get Daniel's five. Daniel's five. And read verse 13 and 14. Come. This is the book of Daniel, chapter 5, and verse 13. It says, Then was Daniel brought in before the king, and the king spake and said unto Daniel, Are thou that Daniel, which art of the children of the captivity of Judah? Showing you, man, Daniel already had fame, man. You how about you, my shot? I gave Daniel fame. The king, you know what I'm saying? That's Nebuchadnezzar's son. Yeah. All right, you know what I'm saying? There's um, asking Daniel, just quick, just speaking, just speaking to Daniel. Go ahead. Yeah, because you you remember when we go into captivity under these heathen nations, they will always take you know the ones with wisdom. You yeah, know, the, the ones. noble, the noble of our people. Right. Mm -hmm. The nobility of our people. That's go right. Ahead. It says, which are of the children of the captivity of Judah, whom the king my father brought out of Jewry. Verse fourteen. I have even heard of thee. That the spirit of the gods is in thee, and that light and understanding, what? That ooh, what? and that light uh -huh. and understanding, light and understanding, man, <laughs> can't get around it, bro. Can't get around that righteous yeah, light, bro. Acknowledge it. Yep, had to acknowledge it, bro. 
All right, and like I said, only can be given through the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Al Rashad, man. Inspiration yeah. of Yahweh Bashim Al Rashad, man. Yeah. The power of Yahweh Bashim Al Rashad, man. Mm -hmm. You got it, bro. It that says, way. and that light and understanding and excellent wisdom is found in thee. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. That's through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Al Rashad. That's right. Let me get Matthew 5. And we're going to read verses 14 through 16. Matthew 5, 4, and we're going to read kind of quick on that. Matthew Come. 5, 14 through 16. This is the book of St. Matthew, chapter 5, and verse 14. It says, ye are the light of the world. And that's going into the elect, man, the men of the Lord, the prophets, man. Mm -hmm. We're the light, bro. All them damn lies that have been put, that have been put out there, all right? You know what I'm saying? Y'all about had the men of the Lord starting with the elders, apostles, great millstone yeah. on down, man. All right? You know what I'm saying? Bringing down all the goddamn stumbling blocks, man. Yeah. All the snares, man. All right, the Esau done put out there, bro. All right, and, and to the world, man. man. Okay, taking down all those stumbling blocks, man. That's right. Dispelling, dispelling all those fucking lies, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you know his story. At right. the end of the day, his right. fucking stupid theories, man. Yeah, which yeah. Is, which is not no truth at the end of the day. Fucking theories, man. Mm -hmm. All right, bullshit. Shit that can, shit that you can, shit that you can prove that's off at the end of the day. Mm. All right, you can't, you can't, you can't debate the truth, man. Yeah. All right. The theories you can debate that all along because the theories is something that's opinionated, man. Yeah. It ain't all right? rooted in truth. It's not rooted in truth, man. It's objective. Mm -hmm. All right. It's objective information at the end of the day, bro. Really ain't no fucking information. It's just objective. Man. Yeah. All right. Go ahead. This is Saint Matthew five and fourteen. Ye are the light of the world. A city that is set on a hill cannot be hid. Yeah, man. It's truth, man. All mm -hmm. right. Everybody know about the Hebrew Israelites. Yep. To the point to where you have Esau. You know, we just never got to take down our videos, man. All right? We got to have a vocab Malone doing a census on, you know what I'm saying, how many jigs that's waking up, waking back up to the nationality, mm -hmm. all right, and prescribing back to the nationality, yep. you know, which was in the millions, what, about what, eight or nine million people? Mm -hmm. He said, well, probably more than that. Got to be more. You know what I'm saying, at the end of the damn day, mm -hmm. you know? But like I said, that's Jake coming back into what? That, 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 that light, man. Yeah. All right, you know? All right, that light just been shining. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, upon the world, man, going into the elect. Yep. Okay. All right. You can't. You can't. Re, you can't refute. You can't refute it, nope. bro. Cannot. Right. Any of the damn day. Cannot. All right. You got it, bro. And one thing about light, when it when it comes to you cutting on the light in a dark room, mm -hmm. you know, like this world is full of darkness. Mm -hmm. When you cut on the light, the light shines. It overcomes it the darkness. Overcomes everything. It man. spreads. Yeah. And that's what we see. Start yeah. with our their their apostles, their elders, and our apostles and our elders. On down to men like us, mm -hmm. this light is spreading. The truth it's, is spreading. Man. It's hard. It's, it's hard to do. It's, it's hard to do your little thing in the day, when the light. When, when it's light. Yeah. That's why a lot of people they do their little wickedness way in the dark. Yep. It's hard. Dark. It's hard, hard for them to be seen mm -hmm. at the end of the day or whatnot. Mm -hmm. That light. That light revealing everything. Everything. That light revealing everything, <sighs> man. You know. If you got it, brother. This is Saint Matthew five and fifteen. It says, "Neither do men light a candle." And put it under a bushel. Yeah, man, because that light represents the truth, man. Yeah. Having that knowledge and understanding, that defeat the whole purpose of you hiding up under the bushel. Nobody can be able to see the light, Nobody man. Gonna see the light. So you just like that damn unprofitable servant going back into the talents, the mm -hmm. parables of the talents, where the Jake, you the know what I'm saying? He, he, hid, he hid his talent, mm -hmm. man. Mm -hmm. All right, he hid his talent in the fucking dirt, man. In the dirt, man. Yeah. He didn't do what Yahweh Shemar Shah commanded him to do. So he was unprofitable at the end of the freaking day, man. Uh -huh. All right. Go ahead, brother. Yep. It says. Neither put it and put it under a bushel, but on a candlestick. Mm -hmm. That and it giveth light unto all that are in the house. Give us light, man. Yeah. All right. Give awareness, man. Awakening, man. Mm -hmm. All right. You know what I'm saying? You know, hey, we give you the truth, man. Yep. All right. You know what I'm saying? You know, breaking those chains of fucking darkness that's on your fucking mind. Right. The lies that you know what I'm saying that we was taught. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? For being in Esau's fucking goddamn wicked ass damn kingdom, man. Yeah. All right. You know, going through his fucking food system, man. Mm -hmm. All right. And, and this truth ain't here. This uh, it's on the front front forefront. That's right. This how Yahabah Shemal Shah set it up. Internet, worldwide web, man. Yeah. That's why Yahabah Shemal Shah created the internet for the truth to go out, man. Mm -hmm. All right. You know, on top of the rooftops, man. Right. All right. You and know, we in the gates of the city. We yeah. We right there. We yeah. In front of everybody, man. For the whole world to see, man. This yeah. video gonna get uploaded, and they're gonna go throughout what the four, four corners, corners man. man. All right. Um, right. you, you finished that one or you had some more on that? Uh, verse 16. Yeah, verse 16. Go ahead. St. Matthew 5 and 16, it says, Let your light so shine before men. Let what? Let your light so shine before men. So so that also shows you we have to let our light shine. Yeah. That means that's a that's action right there. Mm -hmm. That's fucking action. Yep. All right, end of the day, man. Yep. So that means, you know what I'm saying, not only 
you got you you got you got to be teaching it and be talking it, but you got to be walking it. Walking most, it. most importantly, you got to be walking it, bro. Mm -hmm. So 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 nobody should be able to say any manner of wickedness about you, man. Yeah. At the end of the day, when you move in and you walk in the spirit of your how about your mouth was shot, your walk is supposed to be different from the people in the fucking world, mm -hmm. man. All right. Okay. So no, you're supposed to be bringing no fucking guns and choppers. At camp, bro. How, how you letting your light shine, man? man? You doing rap videos and shit. How, right. how, how, is, how is your light shining, bro? Mm -hmm. You trying to make the Hebrew Israelites, you know what I'm saying? You know, you making the Passover, some damn family friendly shit, right, bro. Right. How, how you letting your light shine? How you, anybody, how, anybody, how, you, how you showing the separations of righteousness compared to wickedness at the end of the day? How you showing the separation, man? To Jake, man, at the end of the day, bro. Yeah. All right? So you're not letting your fucking light shine, man, when you're doing that, bro. Mm -hmm. You're being part of the fucking world, man. Right. When you want to appeal to the fucking world mm -hmm. because of numbers, man. Yep. Because of getting your numbers up, that's more money, man. That's right. what the thing you niggas care about, your revenue, man. Money. All right? Yep. And our light is shining. We're letting that light shine. You know, we're walking in this truth. Mm -hmm. And that's why you have these other Israelite camps that's in darkness, you mm -hmm. know, because they, they're going off on the doctrine, man. Fair. You have these, these other uh, Israelites in these other camps. They window shopping with GMS, where All the right. true doctrine, where the light is, man. Right. You know? You had, you finished it or you had some more? You finished uh, it? Verse finish 16? it out. Uh, this is St. Matthew 5 and 16. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works. There and you go. glorify your father which is in heaven yeah man that's that gonna be the elect man yep. all right so they show you man you know what i'm saying you know you gotta have your works man mm -hmm. it ain't just about you know it's more to it than just prophesying and teaching you gotta be living it you gotta be walking it man mm -hmm. at the end of the day like scripture says, you can't just be a hearer this word you have to be a Ooh. doer yeah. as well too man so yeah. it's all about actions at the end of the day bro mm -hmm. and just be and just sitting up there breaking scriptures down and you ain't living it man right, right. Be just, you be deceiving your own self man mm -hmm. Let me get St. John 1 and 4, bro. St. John 1 and 4. St. John 1 and 4. And yep. eventually, if you ain't living, it's going to show. Yeah, it's going to show, man. The most high, you know what I'm saying? He's going to sift your ass out, man. Mm -hmm. You're going to be sifted out, bro. Simple as that, man. Ain't no faking in the truth, bro. That's right. Bro, you can fake it in the world all day, but you can't fake it in the truth, man. Cannot. All right, you know? This is St. John chapter 1 and verse 4. It says, In him was life, and the life was the light of men. What? Woo. In him was life, and the life was the light of of men man that, that break yourself down brother that break yourself down let me get saint john three and mm -hmm. saint saint john three and read verse 19 21 we're gonna end with that brother we're gonna end with that man this is saint john chapter three and verse 19 and this is the condemnation that light is come into the world. Yeah, the truth has come into the world, man. Mm -hmm. It started with our big bro Yahweh Shah through the power of Yahweh, man. Yes, sir. And Yahweh Shah, he reigned that, he reigned that, uh, he sent the uh, Rakar Kadash, which is the, 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 the comforter, which is the Holy Spirit, yep. down upon the elect, mm -hmm. you know, over 2,000 years ago. And guess what? You know what I'm saying? The spirit of prophets is subject to the prophets, mm -hmm. pursuing back to 1 Corinthians 14 and 32. That's right. Rakar Kadash going to hit. The men of the Lord, the elect again, starting mm -hmm. with Elder Abba Bibbis, which that was Elijah coming back in the spirit of Yahweh Bashima was shot. That's right. On That's to our elders things. apostles today, on to the elder bishops today, on down to us today, bro. Mm -hmm. I rise out, we pray we are those men. All right. All right. Come. Go ahead. This is St. John chapter 3 and verse 19. And this is the condemnation that light has come into the world. Mm -hmm. And men love darkness rather than light. Yeah, they love darkness, man, because they love 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 wickedness, man. Yep. All right. And it is easy to be wicked, man. That's that's not that, that's, that's yeah. you know, you can easily We're be wicked all damn wicked day. World. It's easy, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you know, but be righteous, man. All right, you know what I'm saying? Not to fall for the fucking temptations of this world, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? You know, hey, that's work at the end of the damn day, man. That's work, man. Cause we in these damn fucking fleshly uh, goddamn fucking corruptible goddamn right, fucking bodies. bodies at the end of the day, yeah. man. So and that's what Jake, that, Jake, and really what it is, it's a Brock the Hour, Brock, Brock the Hour, Brock the Hour shot. Mm -hmm. What Jake, what, what Jake don't want to do, two thirds don't want to do, they don't want to fucking sacrifice. Mm. See, you ain't gotta make no sacrifice when you're being wicked as fuck. Mm. Wickedness, man. Being in the world, you gotta make no sacrifice. Yeah. Being righteous, you gotta make that sacrifice. Right, right. And guess who that sacrifice? You. You that mm. sacrifice. Oh, yeah, how about Shimi how we shot, man? 12. There you go, man. All right. You gotta leave all things, man. Yeah. Don't get stupid to leave all things. You still gotta go, you know, you know your responsibilities. You gotta handle, you can't, your, you gotta handle your responsibilities. Mm -hmm. But yeah, how about Shimi how shot the truth? It's first and foremost, man. Anything that gets in, in front of this truth to try to hinder you in the truth. That shit have to be cut off, man. We you gotta trim. Price. You gotta trim that fat. We bought with a price yeah. from Yahweh Bashim Shimon with That's right. All right. Simple as that, bro. Mm -hmm. All right. And that great reward. That great reward is gonna gonna come to those men of the Lord that stood that stood stiffly and boldly 
for the name of Yahweh Bashim Al Bashah, man. That's right. And we want to be those men, man. That's right. Like we pray we are those men. Right. If exactly. we endure to the end. That's right. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Con. This is St. John chapter 3 and verse 19, the latter. It says, And men love darkness rather than light because their deeds were evil. Mm -hmm. Wicked ass two thirds. They're going to continue to do uh, wickedness. They're going to continue to uh, buck up against this truth because this is light, man. And mm -hmm. they're walking in darkness. And they, they don't seek to uh, walk in that light, that truth, until ultimately the Lord delete their ass. You know, right. and they get brought back into the kingdom, man. All in right. their right state of mind. Let's go, let's go, let's go. It's verse 20. It says, For everyone that doeth evil hateth the light, neither cometh to the, See, the light. light. Represents righteousness, man. Mm -hmm. the light it show you light represents righteousness right. at the end of the day, bro. That's right. All right, niggas still want to smoke their weed, still want to commit adultery, mm -hmm. still want to eat their fucking pork, still want to keep the customs of the heathen, still want to celebrate their pagan ass fucking holidays, yeah, still want to believe in fucking Egypt. They ain't, they, they don't want to give up the 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 the, the, the NBA, the, the football, <laughs> yeah. and all that bullshit. Bread and they bread and circus party and the shit. Picnics, or uh, uh, family reunions and shit, uh -huh. vacations and shit, at all, going on cruises and all that shit. Right. Want to see the world and all that bullshit. They want to give up the shit of the world, man. Mm -hmm. All right, you know, go to little concerts and all that bullshit. All right, still want to do the things of the world, man. Mm -hmm. Giving in the marriage. All right, you ain't nothing wrong with giving the marriage. You gotta know what time we in. That yeah, you gotta know, what time, you know what time we in, bro. Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead, brother. As, niggas, as we... niggas rather give in the damn marriage and shit. They, they come out there and, and bring the truth out, bro. Yep. All right, you know we love women. Is, we love women more than you niggas, man. Right. All right, but we in fucking order, man. All right, we ain't gonna be no slave. We ain't gonna be no servant to no damn woman at the end of the damn That's day. That's right. Bro. That's right. All right, and we know that Yahweh Shemashah come before everything at the end of the day. We ain't gonna put our woman before the truth, man. Mm -hmm. That's different between us, man. But we right. love women. We love plenty of them, man. Mm -hmm. All right, and get it twisted. All right, we ain't no moles over here. We ain't no fucking moles over here. Yeah. Go ahead, brother. Yeah. Finish up. All right. Uh, Baba Kushai, you know, just going back to the precept you already brought out, Proverbs uh, six and twenty three. It says, "For the commandment is a lamp, and the law is light, and reproof of instruction are the way of life." And go going back to Saint John three, and uh, verse twenty, it says, "For every one that doeth evil hateth the light." They ultimately hate. You know, the commandment, you know, when we bring out that you got to repent, turn back to your Shimiao Shah, keep his law, statutes, and commandments, you know, follow his commands. Hey, they ultimately hate the word of the Lord, man, mm -hmm. which is a lamp unto us, man. Mm -hmm. you no, know, a light. It says, uh, for everyone that doeth evil hateth the light, neither cometh to the light, least his deeds should be reproved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They want to continue to be niggas, man. Yeah. You know? And you know what I'm saying? And pretty much, man, that's it, man. That's the end of the listen. Yeah. All right, you know what I'm saying? Hey, this little light of mine, I'm gonna let, let it shine. shine. <laughs> sure. hey, hey, man, that's how we gotta be, man. Gotta sure. let that light shine, man. Yep. Let that light shine, bro. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's why I made, that's why I made um, entitled this video. Let, the, hey, let that light shine, let man. Shine. Let, let that light stay shining, man. Mm -hmm. Let your light stay shining. Man. That's right. That's the name of the video. Let your light stay shining, man. Mm. All right, but with that, man, we pray and we hope that this um, listen was edifying to the body of hopeful elect. Right. And with that, we want to end by giving all praises and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rekakadash. Secondly, we want to give double honors to the elders of apostles, great millstone, who rule well. And third, we want to give salutation to all the Aku, the sort of hopeful elect that pushing forth this word and the truth and righteous sincerity throughout the four corners. Shalom, 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 shalom. Shalom. Shalom to hopeful elect of Israel. Shalom, shalom. shalom. shalom.